A quarter of a million acclaimed the coronation of the son of a North Italian sharecropper as Pope John XXIII, the 262nd Supreme Pontiff of the Roman Catholic Church. A proud family sees him born into St. Peter's in the course of the five-hour ceremony, a ritual rich in symbolic significance, a pageant of ancient and medieval splendor. Two footmen bear the papal chair into the Basilica, Christendom's largest church for the pontifical mass. On hand are ranking members of the hierarchy, old world nobility, and representatives of most of the free world. The climax comes as the new pope appears on the balcony and takes his place to receive the triregnum, the three-tiered crown that symbolizes the absolute authority of the pontiff over the church. Nicola Cardinal Canali, senior deacon of the Sacred College, crowns John the 23rd at one minute before 1 p.m. Roman time. As a mighty cheer rises, the great bells of St. Peter's thunder in salute and rejoicing. Silence falls as the Pope gives the formal and traditional blessing, Orbi et Orbi, to the city and the world followed by the apostolic blessing to the assembled throng, and the new papal reign commences. Yeah.